Hey guys, this is Tui Me here, and I'm going to be reviewing and comparing both small sets from the Spider-Man series, the new one and the original one. These sets both go for around 13 US dollars, so I'm going to be taking a look at the first one. So the first one is called Spider-Trike vs. Electro, and it comes with Electro, Spidey, and the Spider-Trike. And I'll show you the next one. The next one is called Carnage's Shield Sky Tack. Comes with Carnage, Miles Morales, Spider Man, a Super Jumper, a Shield Copter or something out of the other, and a Shield Pilot. So, first off, I want to get out of the way is the Spider-Man. So, depending on which set to buy, it really depends on the Spider-Man. Because, if you don't have a preference, I'd say go for Miles Morales since he is exclusive to the set. The Spider-Man comes in almost every single Spider-Man set, besides this one, of course. <clears throat> um, then the next preference would be the villain. So... It depends which one you prefer. Um, Carnage, I do think, looks a lot cooler than Electro. Electro does have um, very translucent pieces that are really neat. They both have little spinny things. See, Carnage has the spinny tentacles, and Electro is like a spinny platform that he uses. Uh, Electro does come with a jewel that he steals and some lightning. The lightning is very cool, and Electro... They're both very cool. Carnage, I think, is a cooler looking figure because, you know, you don't see many sets with Carnage in it. And Electro, you know, he's just, eh, kind of bland, in my opinion. I mean, if you guys would prefer Electro, definitely get this set. If you prefer Carnage, get the other one. But, it doesn't end there. This, the Carnage set, <clears throat> also comes with a shield pilot. So, in addition, this one comes with three minifigures instead of just two. So, here is the pilot. Um, he's kind of bland, but he does have a lot of detail on it. Got the shield, and he even has two faces. So, that is a plus. Now, let's talk about the vehicles. So, as for vehicles, we have this, which I'm not sure what to call it really, but it does have a lot of mobility. This opens up and down. This can go all the way up or all the way down. I prefer just one notch. Same with these. And I like these pieces that have like the turbines. That's really neat. And comes with a lot of these pieces. These can also move up and down. And as for missiles, it has these little ones where you push down and the stud flies out. I personally prefer those over the flick fire missiles within this set. So this set, we got Spider Trike. I don't really like the design. I wish these were like angled down a bit, but it does look just fine. So basically Spider-Man rides on top of it and then you can fling them at Electro like so, which I really don't like that. Doesn't really work for me. And I personally prefer a seat that they stay in instead of smooth pieces. And it has the flick fire missiles, which you just push and it comes out, which I'm not a fan of either. So, that is basic comparison, and also if you want a super jumper, it does come within this set, but I'm not a huge fan of those. But, overall, if you do want the regular Spider-Man for really cheap, definitely get this set. If you want a bunch of exclusives, um, and a big, like a good deal for what you're paying for, then definitely get the Carnage set. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Bye.